video shows how the SkyCube solar panels and hinges work. Uh, this is a spare, uh, most of the spare of the SkyCube satellite. Uh, we use it for engineering and test purposes. I've got it sitting on the edge of a table. Uh, three of the four solar panels are sitting on the table. The fourth one is hanging off the table. Um, I'm going to first put it back into its pack configuration. Uh, and by the way, the wires sticking out of the satellite are radio antennas. Um, these will actually be stowed behind the solar panels during launch. So this is how the satellite launches. Actually, all four solar panels are packed up along the sides of the satellite. You can see that the hinge uh, holds everything in place. And uh, when the satellite deploys, the hinges open and go from an angle of zero degrees to 180 degrees. And obviously it happens a bit faster than that. They're spring-loaded, but that's the idea. You can see that there's two hinges. Uh, the second hinge at the top of the solar panel wing attaches the wing to the satellite. And the second hinge, which I'm centering on here, just connects the two solar panels together. Um, you'll notice that our solar panels actually open uh, not quite to a nice uh, parallel angle. This is how we'd like them. We'd like everything to be you know, perfectly straight, extended from the side of the satellite. The problem is that our hinges as they're currently designed actually open to an angle of more than 180 degrees. Um, this is zero degrees here. Uh, that would be 180 and that's actually a little more than 180. Um, it's all because of the uh, sort of ricketiness in the hinge mechanism. Uh, things, the parts just don't line up perfectly and that builds into this angle. The things that have to critically fit are uh, when the solar panel wing is closed, the spacing uh, from the edge of the CubeSat to the top of the solar panel has to be less than nine millimeters. So all of this stuff along here, the entire hinge and the uh, solar panel PCB itself, when it's folded up, it has to have a combined thickness of less than nine millimeters. And, and really even better than uh, less than seven and a half millimeters would be ideal. Um, that's really the most critical measurement. Uh, we can place the holes for the rivets that connect the, the hinge to the panel almost anywhere. Um, you know, we can build new solar panel PCBs uh, to fit a, a different placement of hinges. And really the most critical thing is just that the overall worksmanship has to be pretty solid. Um, this packed dimension here, again, along the edge of the satellite, this from edge of solar panel to edge of satellite, including all the hinge, uh, has to be less than uh, nine millimeters total, better than seven and a half, ideally. And uh, when it opens, it just uh, has to open nice and neatly and end up sort of hanging straight down off the side of the satellite. That's, that's ideally what we're looking for. Thanks a bunch. Hope this makes sense, and we'll look forward to seeing what we can do. Uh, take care. Bye-bye.